Hey guys and welcome to today's vlog. So I am doing a day in the life of my pregnant sister, sister-in-law. So stay tuned and I hope you guys enjoy the day. I'm just gonna go through the day as she would, eat the foods that she does and do the things that she does. So I have my breakfast right here. First she starts with some coffee um, in the morning. So I had some coffee and then two hours later she has her breakfast. So here is what she has pretty much every single day. All right, we are making some toast with peanut butter and I have my All-American birthday cake peanut butter. I love All-American. If you guys have not tried it, make sure to give it a try. One of my teammates actually has a discount code. It is KBLISSFIT, K-B-L-I-S-S-F-I-T and you will save some money on your order. And then she also has some honey bunches of oats. I got this new frosted kind with some milk and you guys know I'm gonna use my almond milk. So stay tuned for the final product. All right, cereal is done. I'm just finishing my toast right now. But I'm actually gonna have some protein, so I'm gonna have my MRE Light. This is the gingerbread cookie. So, gonna have this, and I actually have to go to the vet. Denver has a vet appointment in like 30 minutes. So, we're gonna take off here in just a bit. I will check in with you guys in a little bit later. We are back from the vet, and somebody was a scaredy cat shaking like a little leaf the whole time. <laughs> But you did a good job, right, girl? Oh, yes. Good girl. <sighs> Do you guys want to go for a walk? Do you want to go for a walk? <laughs> All right. Let's go. All right, we just got back from our walk and I completely forgot to mention, I actually got my eyebrows done yesterday, so I got them microbladed. And so if they look a little funny, um, I'm taking care of them right now. Um, so yeah, I'm going back in six weeks for the follow-up appointment to get them retouched, filled in, and changed to my liking if I have anything that I want to change about it. So overall, I really, really like them. Um, it was a great experience. It didn't really hurt me. Um, I actually fell asleep during one of them. Um, when she was doing this one, her hand was over my nose, so it was like hard to breathe. So I'm like practicing my breathing. Whenever she'd go away, I would take a huge deep breath in. So then I'm very claustrophobic, so I felt like I was really constricted. Um, anyways, we just got back from our walk, and part of the thing that Ashley likes to do for her 30-minute workout is clean the house. Another option is 30-minute nap or put your shoes and socks on. So clearly it takes her quite a while to get her shoes and socks on and she considers that a workout. So I am going to clean. I have some laundry going on right now. I'm just going to clean the kitchen, vacuum the, um, not Furbo, the Roomba just got done doing its hour and 45 minute sweep around the house. So I'm just gonna touch up on that. And yeah, that's about it for right now. But she has her snack. I'm a little behind on her feeding schedule, but I did wake up a little bit later than she does, so I'm kind of on track, I guess you want to say. So I'm going to have a smoothie right now. I will show you guys what is in the smoothie and then get to cleaning. All right, here is the ingredients for this fruit smoothie. The only thing I'm missing is frozen fruit, but I think I have enough carbs going here. So I'm going to do some banana. She says peach yogurt, orange juice, milk. I'm using almond milk, handful of spinach, and then the fruits and greens mix. So here we go. And of course, I'm gonna add some protein, so I have my MRE Light Strawberry Shortcake. Give it a try. It smells really good. I think the peach yogurt is an awesome touch. Dang, that is insane. The peach and the banana. Um, I'm not getting too much of the strawberry shortcake protein, which is what I use. And this is actually not quite cold enough for me. I usually use frozen spinach, and I forgot my spinach to be in the freezer. I think I'm going to add some ice cubes and let this chill for a little bit. 
but it's definitely a bomb drink. I think adding a little bit of fat, some sort of coconut oil, peanut butter, almond butter, something, I think that would like completely top it. But I will just save some fats for a snack later on because this is pretty much like zero fat in here. All right, lunch is up next. So take a look at this beauty. I am so excited to eat this. So for lunch, she typically has a salad, a romaine and spinach mixed salad with pecans, dried cranberries, apple, feta, and vinaigrette. I do not have dried cranberries, apple, feta, or vinaigrette, so I have a honey Dijon dressing. I do have a blueberry and spinach dried mix, which is er, blueberry and pecan mix. It's so, so good. I got it from Walmart. And then I also added some tomato, cucumber, red, and orange peppers, and I think that's everything, but I'm going to take this, run a couple errands, and go to Starbucks because Thursdays at Starbucks is happy hour. Buy one, get one free, grande or larger, and I'm going to park it and do some computer work. So a little bit, uh, blah. <laughs> A little bit about my sister-in-law, Ashley. She is my age, we're both 30. She is due February 24th, and she's having a little girl, and she works from home. She's a graphic designer, freelance designer, and yeah, she gets to work from home. It's a glorious life. My brother is a professor at K-State, so yeah, that's what she does. So she works from home. I kind of work from home too besides being a flight attendant. So I'm going to take you to a coffee cut shop because I do my best work there. It's really hard with the pups back there who want attention. Um, I literally just cleaned the house. It doesn't look like it because I bought all my food and stuff ready to go. But I just cleaned the house and yeah, I'm going to go do some computer work now. So stay tuned and I will see you guys at the coffee shop. All right, I feel like I'm about to throw up slash pass out. I have a terrible migraine and I've been having blurred vision for the last few hours. Went to Starbucks, did some computer work, but I've literally been struggling. I cannot concentrate very well. Everything is taking me probably at least 50% longer because I cannot concentrate or like remember what I'm doing. Ooh, so I am going home and I'm going to take something for my migraine and go to sleep. I feel like so terrible right now. Um, anyways, I do have another snack I'm supposed to have. Um, Ashley has a either wheat thins and no, she has wheat thins and sharp cheddar, I think. But I have this gluten free little pretty much air puffed snack um, and then where are you where are you I don't know where it is um, I have one of the wedges um, like I said I literally cannot think right now and I don't know where it is laughing cow cheese wedge and Ashley has wheat thins and sharp cheddar cheese but this is what I'm gonna have so yeah I will have that when I get home lots of water, my headache medicine, and then take a nap. So stay tuned for whatever else. I still have dinner and another snack, um, but we'll see where I'm at with my macros. I feel like I'm pretty low. Oh, I did have um, messy monkeys, my, I like I said, I cannot think, cinnamon, an apple, apple cinnamon, and I had some oh my gosh, I literally cannot think. This is so frustrating. Um, pistachios. I had pistachios. Literally couldn't think of that. Um, anyways, okay, I'm going home now. I'll talk to you guys later.
as you can see, I have a couple of deliveries and I want to unbox them and go through them with you, show you what I got. So I am getting bi-monthly subscriptions with Twisted Foods. So they send me 15 different meal combinations. So I get actually uh, 12 meals and then three snacks with that. And I love it. So this is my second box that I got. And the food quality is literally so good. It's like restaurant quality. The portions are huge and the macros are on point. They actually talk to you over the phone and go over your macros with you. They make sure that they are sculpting the meals to foods that you like and the macros that you are looking for. So most of mine are a little bit higher carbs and kind of lower fat because I'd rather have them like around my workouts. So stay tuned and let's see what we have. Um, by the way, if you want to order, go to the link in my description box. And if you just fill out the questionnaire, just mention my name and you will get 20% off of your order. And I promise you, you will not be disappointed. So when I open it up inside, this is what it looks like. Everything is all organized in baggies, so it's not falling all over the place. And they give you extra containers in case any of yours do break during the shipping process, which is awesome and a super, super nice touch. And then it is actually frozen with this um, single use only. Yeah, super frozen and it's, I guess it's like stronger than ice, but I don't really know what it is. So anyways, that's what it comes with and stay tuned. All right, so I'm just going to go over everything and tell you what it is and what the macros are. And yeah, we'll start with that. So far, it's looking like everything is completely different from my order two weeks ago. And it's honestly, it's a surprise for me because I know my macros and my goals and the foods are literally a surprise, which is the best part. I think you're not choosing foods and like you're not choosing the standard meals that you do from pretty much any other meal prep company. They give you foods uh, according to what you like and you just, not foods that you dislike. So anyways, here we go. All right, first we have chicken with jasmine rice and squash. It is 371 calories, eight fat, 47 carbs, and 28 protein. They actually have like 0.32, so like it's very, very precise um, macronutrient profile. And we have chicken salad with sweet potato fries and zucchini. I guess I can show you. Even though it's frozen, it's not gonna be as pretty, but it still is pretty darn pretty. Um, calories, 265, 5.4 fat, 29.8 protein, at carbs, 25. Point one protein. Chicken with yucca and squash. I don't really know what that word is. Y-U-C-C-A. 347 calories, 7.5 fat, 42 carbs, and 29 protein. This looks pretty darn good. And then we have a bourbon meatball with brown rice and green peas. 414 calories, 8 grams of fat, 49.7 carbs, 30 protein. Then we have pep cheesy bread, pepperoni cheesy bread. Uh, I don't really know. This must be one of the snacks, I'm assuming. Maybe. No, maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> 342 calories, 17 fat, 15 carbs, and 30 protein. This looks pretty darn bomb. It's made with um, coconut as the first ingredient, so it's more like a keto type. Not really keto, but, you know, you guys get what I'm saying. And then we have breakfast pizza with mild cheddar, plus 30 carbs. So we have 209 calories, 7 grams of fat, 16 carbs, plus 30 carbs, and 14.3 protein. This looks pretty darn good for a breakfast pizza. And next up, we have caramel white chocolate protein bar. And looks like there's a frozen banana in here as well. So a protein bar and a banana. Banana is not too appetizing looking, but that's what happens with frozen bananas. Um, so yeah, we got a frozen banana on our hands. Then we have turkey with sweet potato and zucchini. I'm a huge fan. They're sweet potato that I've had before. It's so good. I eat the skin and everything. 359 calories, 7.8 fat, 43.7 carbs, and 30.5 protein turkey with sweet potato and zucchini so another one of these which I am totally all for that because like I just said I love the sweet potatoes and I love the turkey and the zucchini as well chicken feta bacon with white rice and green peas 387 calories 7 fat 43.8 carbs and 30.9 protein then we have chicken with diced white potato and green peas this thing is heavy guys like it's literally 
so heavy and like the portions are huge and amazing. 459 calories, 7 fat, 60 carbs, and 32.3 protein. Awesome for a post-workout meal. Definitely great macros for that. Spi or cheesy spicy chicken with diced white potato and squash. 442 calories, 6.2 fat, 58.9 carbs, and 34.4 protein. Again, another perfect post-workout meal. And last we have turkey roast with white rice and Asian stir fry. 359 calories, 7 fat, 43 per carbs, and 26 protein. Like I said, those pre and post workout macro ratio is awesome. See this one's broken, so I'm gonna put that in a new container. So that's why they give them to you, so people aren't complaining, because there's nothing to complain about. And we have a couple more things in here. All right, so just a few extras. We have blueberries and raspberries, and it's literally just 13.8 carbs. And we have baked egg. Ooh, that looks kind of good. Oh, eat with fruit. I like how they give you constructions and they write it on there handwritten and everything. Okay, so one, two, um, egg whites, two egg whites in here. And then we have baked oatmeal, banana rolled oats, egg whites. That sounds really good. She gave me numbers and I forget. Okay, so baked egg, eat with fruit. You guys are about to die on me. Okay, anyways, you guys get the point. This stuff's good, legit. Go check it out, you will not be disappointed. One more box for today. I have some chocolate assortment. There were these puppy treats, candle. These cinnamon hearts are like my favorite. Face mask and those things. These things are like my favorite, but they are so high in calories. 